Parce qu'apparemment, il y a des milliards d'auditeurs qui le veulent en anglais. Je vais faire une présentation sur Apple Stacker 3. So, uh, hi. I'm going to show you uh, the newly released version of uh, Apple Stacker 3, which, which has been released like uh, a few weeks ago. So it's still in beta and uh, it's still changing. So what I'm actually going to show you is is very different from what you can download. So um, I'm only really fo uh, going to focus on what has changed according to uh, Arco Tracker 2. So uh, as you can see, I hope, you've got a newly uh, customized interface which is much simpler according uh, from the Arco Tracker 2. So uh, what the most like striking features is the linker. I'm going to show you to load a song. So this one, which you already know. So uh, there are no more uh, like hundreds of, uh, of numbers of tracks. Madra, woo, Madra, woo. We love you. Um, so everything has been automatically uh, converted into patterns, like regular trackers. Uh, so no more uh, playing with hundreds of numbers, uh, which was uh, quite complex. Um, and the uh, instrument editor also has been completely uh, overhauled. So no more numbers uh, everywhere. Everything is graphical, so you can play with uh, the mouse, but also uh, edit it with the keyboard. So we, I'm going to show you that. Christy, hello. <laughs> so, I'm going to create a new song. So, basically, we've got. You can uh, play with the PC uh, keyboard or the MIDI keyboard if you have uh, one plugged. Um, so, uh, there is already a first instrument which I'm going to edit. Okay, so what we can see is that there are no not a lot of data, only the uh, envelope. Now I'm going to uh, like make a loop somewhere because I want to. Hopla. So now I'm going to loop here. Hopla. I don't know. So I'm going now to uh, introduce a more complex sound, like a uh, hardware sound. So what I can do is select a type of sound. Everything is, uh, as you can see, it's, it is square. So I'm going to um, do something else. Oh, now we've got a, a software into hardware. I'm, going, I'm not going to explain the technicalities, just uh, it sounds great. So um, I'm going to change the ratio between the, hard, the software and the hardware curve. And the nice thing is that everything is visual, so you can hear exactly what you're doing and simply have fun and not uh, spend an, uh, an, amount, an amount of time uh, thinking too much about oh, what, what is this. Just play with it and uh, you're going to see that uh, we can create a very nice sound with just a feeling with uh, the bars and everything. So let's go. And this is new, it does not exist in the Arco Stacker too? So yeah, um, good remark. Uh, it already existed, like the engine uh, is doing the same thing as Arco Stacker 2 but um, a lot of options were actually over, overlooked because uh, it was too complex. And now you can just uh, have fun and uh, have your kids uh, play with it and uh, it will sound right or not. Or not. But uh, it will be fun. So.
Bravo Creating a crappy sound, and that actually... Correct me if I'm wrong, but I never often heard that kind of sound on a, on a CPC or MSX or whatever. So it was just me uh, crapping uh, some stuff, but uh, it already uh, sounded nice. Bravo Sound whatever. Uh, what else? Uh, you, you've got various type sound, which was, uh, it was already available in, uh, in Aposta Club Truth. I'm not going to, to spend time explaining that. Huh? Sorry. <laughs> Lunch. Sorry? And uh, people want to eat. Um, what else? Uh, the players are the same as uh, the one on Aposta Club Truth. Some bugs have been uh, removed. But uh, and, uh, and uh, I'm actually working right now on a player uh, with DT drums, DT drums and sample. So you can have both PSD sounds and one channel in each channel uh, with uh, samples one at a time. Bogus. And of course, uh, everything uh, the sources are here, are here so with uh, with testers. So you just compile the stuff and it uh, just works. Uh, what else? Uh, you've got. Um, the option to optimize your instruments and later patterns and, and whatever, but everything is already optimized on export. Uh, on the export, you've got uh, the classical AKG, AKM, uh, various players according to uh, what you want, more speed or, um, or more um, uh, small, smaller uh, music. Uh, it's all the players support sound effects and uh, you've got player for uh, for Z80 and uh, Atari ST, uh, Auric, MSX, uh, Spectrum, uh, Specnext uh, and various uh, how uh, specific, uh, specific hardware like uh, Play City on CPC, Darky and uh, all that kind of uh, crap. Uh, Amstrad Plus? <laughs> Amstrad Plus, uh, not, not using the DNA. Yeah. Anyway, je t'enverrai mon player alors. Yes, yes. So uh, anyone wanting Arcostracker to support a new user platform can just uh, contact me and uh, we can uh, we can work on uh, on the specific players. <laughs> and uh, yes, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah, we are working. Prolatron is working on the Enterprise, the NS two hundred. And uh, NPCW, of course. NPCW, very soon. So, yeah, that's it. Uh, so, Africa 3 has already a temporary, web, temporary website. Uh, you can download it right now. It's, it's already stable, even though it's uh, advertised as a beta. And uh, the website also has a lot of tutorials. They are as clear as I could. So, any beginner, even beginner on music or uh, whatever, uh, can uh, play. It's a uh, step-by-step uh, tutorials, so you can create sound music and uh, and have fun. That's it. Thank you. Merci. Bravo.